Today's question is, Mike, if the state age of consent law in the state I live in is an age like 14, but my parents say you are not to be sexually active until you are 16 or 17, how come my parents are giving me an age that is different than the law? If I'm legally able to do this, why don't they want me doing this when I'm legally able to, or why won't they at least give me that freedom to do that? Here's why a lot of parents have a different age guideline than state law. Because we have some states where the age is very young of age of consent. And so it in no way means that that's the ideal age for people to be sexually active. For instance, I've been in these states, talked at schools where I said to the students, do you think a 14-year-old is ready to be making these choices around sexual decision-making? And they're like, no. And then when you ask them, well, maybe if you thought one of them was, what are the odds both are at that age? Going to be mature enough, ready, have the knowledge, have everything they need to make the best choice. And almost every student, every school this has ever been discussed has said, the odds of that happening are like slim to none at that age. That's right. And so what's happening is your parents are saying, we want to create an experience for you that a system for you that when you choose to engage in sexual intimacy, you're ready and that your partner is more likely to be ready. Now, that doesn't mean the age they set, 16, 17, 18, whatever it is, is the age you're going to be ready. It may even be longer than that before you're ready, and that's okay. There's no race here. But what they're doing is they're trying to say, we don't want you to, to be involved with this too early when you're not ready, when it because more likely to be an unhealthy situation where there might be higher odds that it could be a dangerous situation because both partners are not fully aware or have the confidence, the skill set, the knowledge to feel safe in this environment making these choices. So they're trying to create the best case scenario for you. So keep that in mind. And then if you're like, well, I've got another year or two or three, whatever it is, Take that time to learn, right? To learn about yourself, to learn about sexual decision-making so that when you do get to be the age where your parents think it's a good place to be and you believe it's a good place to be, you have the skill set, you have the understanding, you have more sexual maturity to ensure you're in healthy, wonderful situations so that it's mutual for everyone. That's today's question.